I'm just curious of all the roles that you've played, is there one that you hear about the most or that has changed your life the most? Um, well, you know, I, I, it's funny because I, I, I think there's a couple of like kind of turning points, you know, certainly Footless was a big turning point sure. for me. Um, and then I got this part in JFK and mm -hmm. that really was when it came out, I felt a real shift. And I think the shift was that um, it was such a strong character and people, and I had always thought of myself as a character actor, but I think because of Footloose, people kind of thought of me as like a, you know, a pretty boy kind of, you know, pop star yeah. kind of thing, you yeah. know? And, and uh, it's not really who, who I am, you know? And so JFK was really important. Do you get people reciting lines from that movie to you? Yeah. People say lines to me from movies that I don't even remember sometimes. They'll go like, hey, pass the salt. And I'll be like, what? I, <laughs> I don't even know what you're talking about. We all remember you in pass the salt. <laughs> <laughs> JFK was, was uh, crazy. We had this scene where it's, it's very, I mean, I use a lot of really foul language. In That's it. okay. And we're on, we're on a Zoom right now. So you yeah, can right. You okay. Want. Back then, there was the airline looping that you had to do, which you, you had to find a phrase that would fit with your lips for every single curse that you would do. And, and it was always this kind of challenging sort of thing. And I'll never forget, there's a scene where I'm talking to uh, Kevin Costner and I'm saying, you don't know shit, Mr. Garrison, because you never been <laughs> And yeah. I mean, if you look at my lips, it's like I mean, it's kind of like, how, what are you going to put in there? I mean, we're sitting around on a looping stage and everyone's like, uh, what could it be? And uh, the first thing we have to change is the shit. So that has to become squat, right? That's an easy one. Sure, sure. But it's pretty tough to figure out. So I ended up saying, you don't know squat, Mr. Garrison, because you've never been loved by a man. <laughs> <laughs> So if you ever see the clean version of it, you know, spot, Mr. Garrison, because you never had to mow the grass. I'm like, what? <laughs>